welcome to Eat Secret. It's another beautiful morning here in Cumbria and we're off to the Harrogate Home and Gift Trade Fair. I'll see you when we get there. I've got lots of things to show you today um, and I hope you enjoy this video. Something for a change. So here we are coming into Harrogate and as you can see there's a fabulous traffic jam. I thought I was going to be here in like there in 10 minutes time but it could take half an hour judging by this. I don't know how far that goes but it's I think it's generally like this because there was a sign saying queues likely so it must always be like this. Okay. I'll be back in a second when we get to the doors. I missed it. And so if you just look over the road there, it's very different to the other trade shows. Uh, we've got Hall A, which is gifts, and that's where I'm headed. Uh, hall M, which is home. And of course, I'll be going in all of the halls. Um, but we'll start off with gifts because that's what we sorry this is the bit i wanted to show you it's all fantastically open green grass everywhere you can see and this is what's always covered in crocuses i have a feeling i'm meant to turn left here yeah they're home and gift trade only turn left right I'll go. and this is what it looks like as you go in to the home and gift trade fair You've got to show your pass, you can't just get in if you're not trade, but of course more so makes a trade. Okay, so that's the door where we came in and we've just got trade stand after trade stand. So it's a case of walking around until you find what you're looking for. And what I'm looking for today is some lovely glasses or pots to put candles in maybe some pretty gift boxes lovely makeup bags here nice handbags and they're bright Okay, so we'll be back in a second when we get to the bath and body because I'm sure that's what you're interested in most. Okay, so that's the door where we came in and we've just got trade stand after trade stand. So it's a case of walking around until you find what you're looking for. And what I'm looking for today is some lovely glasses or pots to put candles in maybe some pretty gift boxes lovely makeup bags here nice handbags and they're bright Okay, so we'll be back in a second when we get to the bath and body because I'm sure that's what you're interested in most. This is the amazing Bob Cosmetics stand. Look at that, the colour. Look at all those fantastic products right the way along there. Very busy as well. Very busy. Absolutely stunning. All the happy smiling customers. Wow, it's huge. Absolute magic. Look at that. Well worth a visit, I think. Amazing. This is the amazing Yankee Candle Stand absolute class imagine getting to this level it's absolutely beautiful beautiful people as well and heart and home they're pretty back to Yankee Candle
That's a hall through to another hall. Looks like decorations and things through there. House of flavours. Sweeties. Sweeties everywhere. Gorgeous cashmere scarves. Mmm, what a gorgeous smell here. Wow, that smells amazing. Wow, what is going on? No, it's these people, heart of the country. Wow, that is fantastic, the smell of that. Beautiful, beautiful products. I'm not sure everybody likes you taking photos, but got some gorgeous stands look at this beautiful stand here with all the silk flowers just magical so we're just coming into the other hall now and as you can see right in front of us we've got giftware trading who obviously do fantastic christmas decorations little coffee shop over there they're cute little glasses aren't they the scented home. <laughs> yep, so there we've got some lovely gift bags and <laughs> the sales rent from there and then some gorgeous mirrors. Cute little diamante bags. It's sad because um, Some of the stands don't have a lot of people on them. A lot of stands don't have anyone on them. Especially the bag stands I've noticed. And it's a shame because they've got some gorgeous bags. Like those there. They are lovely. Okay, then I think we're going to go into another hall now. I did see some boxes here, but there's nothing there, nothing that I like enough to buy. Okay, so here we've got all of the fantastic jewellery. I'm not really into jewellery, sorry. Not into jewellery myself, but... Wow, there's loads. Beautiful, yeah. Mm. Some of the guy's aftershave is gorgeous. I'm wondering what it is. Shall I tap on someone's shoulder to find out? More handbags, but they seem busy on there. So we're going to have a little bit more of a whiz round and then I'm going to stop filming and start shopping. <laughs> Clothes, scarves, capes. Wow, that's gorgeous. I 
I'm surprised I haven't been told off yet. <laughs> so here we are in another hall, yet another hall, with loads of amazing stuff in. Look at this stand here. If you like a bit of sparkle, you're going to love this. Pretty impressive. And look at the guy's suit. Can you see it? Blue with the red flowers on. Pretty amazing, eh? <laughs> it's actually not that busy. Gosh, it'll cost a fortune to set up here as well. I don't think I've been down this side. Lovely cashmere throws. What I have noticed is there's a lot of country style fabrics. They must all be back in again now. 